Both company representatives met with us respectively and asked us if we would consider extending our collective agreement to allow them the appropriate time to study the pattern of proposal and try to come to grips with achieving the pattern proposal. And obviously we think it makes sense that we get a bargain settlement, a settlement that meets the pattern established at Ford, and we think it makes common sense that we give both Chrysler's and General Motors the opportunity to do their due diligence on the collective agreement we established at Ford. So we have the tentative agreement at Ford Motor Company, and again, if General Motors and Chrysler's respects pattern bargaining, respects equality, re respects the concept of making sure that one company isn't disadvantaged as the other as a result of a collective agreement, we should get a deal. We don't have a lot of time here. I, uh, the facts of the matter is we agreed with the companies that at any time that we have a breakdown, whether it's tomorrow or the day after or tonight, we'll give you 24 hours notice, um, quite frankly, before we withdraw our labor. So this is not an unended response. If it was, they would have asked for two or three weeks. We said, we are gonna maintain 24 hours notice, and the reason you would do that is to maintain the momentum to get the job done, not to procrastinate. Because the folks that are out here today, believe it or not, they got kids and families at home that I'm sure they'd like to go, go home to, although I'm sure they like looking at me. Yeah.